Honorable President Jacob Zuma, Honorable Deputy President Cyril Ramaphosa, Honorable Ministers and Deputy Ministers, Honorable David Makura, Premier of our beautiful province of Gauteng, Honorable Mayor Park Stau of the Gauteng Golden City, fellow countrymen, my peers, ladies and gentlemen, I stand here proud to have been chosen by the families of those who lost loved ones in the brutal events of June 16 to represent them. I stand here, the niece of my proud uncle, Tzeti Mashinini, who gave his life for the freedom of his people. The families I represent include the Petersons. We can still see the limp body of Hector carried by Muisa Makubu and a shocked Antoinette following. The families of the murdered Hastings Nlovu, the dedicated Dr. Edelstein who came into the township to change the lives of those less fortunate than him. All of them thought I should carry the baton of the fallen heroes. These families asked me, the niece of my equally heroic uncle Teddy, to stand here to do the following. To thank you, the government of our free country, for continuing to recognize our fallen family members. We thank you for continuing to remind our country that without the blood that was spilled so we can be free, there would be no democratic South Africa today. I wish to emphasize our youth of our country. During this month of youth, let us remember that the only person who can liberate you as a young person is you. No amount of drugs, chasing material possessions, or outward wealth can change your situation. Hashtag education, education and more education will liberate you. Enjoy your youth day and the rest of the youth month and use every minute of your life to make your life better. Hashtag no to drugs, no to the abuse of women and children. Hashtag no to the burning of schools. Hashtag long live the struggle of our country. I thank you.